Tonight on eFix, Gary gets caught in some ectoplasm. An old favourite is back. Yes, it's the race wall. Joe gets comfy in his favourite chair. And secret millionaire Craig Gifford lands in the studio. Hello and welcome to the live stream and this one being the, the end of our live feed event that we had in October, Gordon. It is, which means prizes. So we're going to give away, tonight, he never, on oh, oh we're, that there. wasn't me by the way, tonight on eFix, <laughs> yeah, nice to think that I haven't, I'm going to try really hard tonight not to make any mistakes, I'm going to be looking here and looking there and just caught you out. So yeah, that means you don't let me give away prizes at the start. Just the one, yeah. One off, or right, okay. Two. two. We're going to give away two prizes, so they'll be the main prizes, the star prizes that we've got to give away today. Yeah, you've got to work up and let me know how this works, you've got to stay on at least, give us a half an hour of your time. Okay, so I think we're going to give away something that uh, has a plaque, Gordon, oh, yeah, and this everyone. is for technical question of the week. Okay, so during the October live feed we ask for your interaction, don't we? Mm -hmm. We love people's comments and we love the questions, and this question will get answered, will it not, later on in the week, Gordon? It will, yeah. Once we've just been past the points of view, team, just to make sure we're not going to get any bounce back when it, uh, when it goes out there. Yeah, absolutely. So this prize goes to Ali Ditta Babu, and he was a comment on YouTube. We don't know whether that's his actual name or his YouTube name. Mm -hmm. So, um, Ali, would you like to get in contact with us? We will also message you. You've got this plaque and the prize coming your way for his technical question, which yeah. was on what? Got, um, it, was on, uh, it was on, it was on, I don't know, where's John? Oh, I nearly caught you out. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to see it you going answer that one. Yeah, so I was asked about um, smoke alarms and do they have to be connected on a dedicated circuit or can they be put on with the lighting circuit? In a domestic dwelling. In a domestic dwelling. Yeah. Yep, so great question that question will be answered is that an ECA question later on in the week or yeah, is that is, a yeah. joke? We'll, we'll release that yeah once we oh, yeah. right okay so yeah. that's sitting there waiting to be released so they'll all be coming out don't panic if you haven't won something this time around we'll give another prize away in a minute mm -hmm. we're, we're in November there will be another live feed event that goes through the back end of November and into early December yeah, in early December yeah we've got all the products in for that at the moment yes we're just working our way through okay so hopefully I've not made any errors so far so you said we're gonna give away two prizes so Ali's won his plaque for technical question I take it we're going to give away the big prize next? No. Okay, who's the next prize for? Bit of a social star. Social star, we love yeah, a social star. Yeah. How do you win a social star award? Uh, well, interact, funny comments, uh, yeah, general interaction, banter, we get all sorts, yeah. Now you talked about in the title, a certain person coming to do, see us. Yeah, yeah. How did you describe that person? It's, uh, it's the uh, hashtag secret millionaire. And we came up with that, didn't we? Uh, no. I'd have loved to. Have, did I come up with Taplin Springs? Uh, no. 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 Okay. Who comes up with great stuff? Uh, well, me normally. <laughs> oh, yeah. yes. But obviously, the way it works at Apex, if it's a great idea, then it's mine. Yes. If it's an unmitigated failure, we distribute that failure around the team. Yes, we all, yeah, we'll get a little bit of that, don't we? <laughs> so, so these are people that are obviously interacting with us on social media, making us laugh all the time, and coming up with these great things. We've, we've stolen almost Taplin Springs. I think it's even a hashtag now on Instagram. So if you want to hashtag in um, that, that would be great as well. But this one's for Secret Millionaire. Secret Millionaire, yes. Who, who come up with the Secret Millionaire? Uh, that was Paul Crumpling. It was yeah. Paul Crumpling, known yeah. on Instagram as? Crumps84. Okay, Crumps84. Yeah. He's also doing some other fantastic stuff that we're gonna obviously send you a prize, Paul, mm -hmm. but he's also doing some other fantastic stuff this month as well, isn't he? He is, well, we're doing it, well, before we get there, so yeah. he's doing that, he gets a prize for that. We, we've oh. obviously got to remember, it is. Oh, yeah. Remembrance Day yeah. as well. Okay, it is, yeah. So. Sorry, I thought we'd come to it afterwards. Yeah, okay. Yeah. yeah, so with the 11th, uh, yeah, and you've got a lot of people in your family, aren't you, in the forces? Yes, yeah, so over the years, yeah. There's a lot of war memorials dotted around the country with a lot of <laughs> Routledges on there. Yeah. And yeah, a lot of active members of the family in at the moment. Nephew just gone in? Yes, yes, yeah, nephew's just, just gone, gone in. in. Billy's just done his basic training. Yeah, so and our mares have gone up already. I think it's amazing. Anyone who, who serves for the country who's willing da to lay down their life for this country is a, a remarkable thing to do. And the people that have laid down their lives in order that we can have the life that we have now mm. so yeah always uh, always should be remembered and of course today especially so yeah, yeah that's that and Paul's trying to do something I think Paul's ex-service as well yeah so we'll just, well. uh, hold on you yeah yeah so Paul is also doing Movember yeah we're not going to bother doing it are we no we're just growing ridiculous moustaches just just because we can yeah. I'm not in the can category, I'm in the yeah, can hope category. I've got bits missing. I think I've got to buy this one in separately just here in order to complete mine. So Paul's doing it. So we've left his link to his um, charity it, page or his it's fundraising It's in the Movember page. ones in there. Yes. So you can do that. Paul will share his dedicated one as well. All right, if okay. anyone else wants to join in the fun, I yeah, uh, okay. can do. All right. Uh, yeah, I mean, they did, we are doing it for a good cause. Obviously, mental health, uh, men's cancer, all those uh, 
nasty things that can affect us. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, so hats off to Paul, and, and Paul looks like he's in my camp. He looks like he's he might be a reluctant grower of a moustache. Well, I'm not exactly. Well, no, no, yeah. But, yeah. yeah. I mean, so, yeah, it's, it's, yeah, not very good. You've started. Started well. Oh, just caught it in the light then. I can see it now. Yeah. No, I can't see it again. <laughs> come this way. Yeah, come this way. Yes, now there it see. is. Now okay, you've started, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so we normally start with the news, so hopefully we're all on board now. Is there anything uh, technical uh, happened? We'll go back to the, yeah, the news. So this week is, uh, yeah, this one we found. <laughs> this is a bumbling electrician risked death when he tampered with underground cable and left 1,251 properties in Stoke-on-Trent without power. Right, okay, so why would a bumbling electrician be messing around with what looks remarkably like me to maybe an 11 kV underground cable? Yeah, well he took on a job to provide some power to some new apartments and, and thought he would uh, save the connection charge. Oh right. Yeah, so do a bit of, bit of cable jointing. You know, so we all like to... did that block of flats need 11,000 volts in it? Well, I promise if you're the sort of person who takes on a bit of yeah, underground jointing work live, <laughs> and it's possibly not your field of expertise, you can make a simple mistake. So it was after the 400 volt three phase and he picked up the 11 kV. Yeah. Wow. Um, okay. yeah, lucky so to be with us, isn't he? Yeah, it's lucky, it's he lucky. was lucky to get fined, I would suggest. Yeah, so he got a £7,000 fine. And he should be very grateful for that because yeah. it could have been, yeah, no, could have been a lot worse. I imagine that was a brown trouser moment when that went off. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah, because so. it must have gone pop, mustn't it? If yeah. all those houses in Stoke on Trent went off. Oh, yeah. yeah. You wouldn't want to drop your insula uninsulated pliers on that, would you? Yeah, so if you've ever been. <laughs> Bumbling electrician, or you know, if you're one of the 1,251 houses in Stoke and Trent, yeah, drop us a line to see if you were affected by that. Okay, so there's two prizes we're giving away. So Paul, who's growing his moustache for Movember, who come up with hashtag Secret Millionaire, and he will appear later on in the live feed, uh, live stream event, and as well as Ali, who's won our technical question of the uh, month. That'll be mm -hmm. available next month as well. So get your great questions in. If it's a great question, it could well be answered by either Joe or the ECA. And we thank the ECA for everything they've done again for us this time round. Mm -hmm. Right then, so we've got through the first section. So yeah. now we must be on to what was stuck to my face, I think, in the opening section. So yeah. if, I, if I get it out for you, I've yeah. got a fox box here for you. Give me a second. It's so I'll get the hand box. cam. Yeah. Where is hand cam? It's over here. So give me a second. I'm gonna press the right button. We're on hand cam. Okay. Yeah. So that's the fox box. What are you going to do? It's a junction box with a moat carrying. It's got ectoplasm in it. Look at that. I know. It's yeah. brand new and your fingerprints yeah. all over it now. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Great, and it? what is that there for? What's the real reason it's got ectoplasm uh, in it? Yeah, it's a, it's, it's a, yeah, it's the I, it's the ceiling for the box. It's the IP seal. Bring your cables in. It seals it off nicely. We have got a review coming out of this soon. Okay. We did the fox box and we also did a little Fred, didn't we? We did one with Fred. Him. So that's the, the big fox box. We've got okay. a job. And we've and got a little Fred. We've got Fred here. I like Fred. Fred, I think he has a brother, Barney. Yeah, okay. And yeah. there are Dino as well, or did I? There is a Dino make, as there well. There is a Dino. Have a look at that on the. Uh, well, I thought obviously it comes with yeah. a regular terminal. Okay, yeah. So I thought, well, I'm going to have to head this off because somebody's bound to ask. No. Will it take away? They, they wouldn't ask that, would they? The minute you see a connector block, you wouldn't follow it with. Well, will it do away go, would you? So we opened up that little fella, and yep. obviously I've made some connections with it and you're going to answer the question now. So we just cut out one minute clip. It's a bit of a loose clip, this one is. So let's see if you can fit three Wagos or Vargos. What are we going for? Depends where you're watching from. Okay, let's go for it. I can get this in. Right, I reckon that'll go in there. I've, got, I've done my slip with a knife. Let's get them. Mm, cozy, that's about as cylindrical as I can get them. Mm -hmm. Are you ready for this? Mm -hmm. oh, there's a lot of gel there. Put your foot on there and push. Oh yes! Just gotta get the gotta get the gland on. Okay. You wouldn't be foolish enough to forget the other one though, would you, Gordon? Clearly you'd need to wipe up uh hmm. Okay, get that on there. Oh, a little bit of edit there. I wonder what you said. So yes, Gordon's proved he can ram three Vargo connectors into a thread. Is I think what he's proved there. I think you can get Wagos in there. Nah, 
inconclusive, I would suggest there. We, we have, uh, you managed to ram yeah. them into the, uh, the, the little fridge. Yeah, 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 have another look at the, yeah, the, yeah, the, the damage you've done to that. Let's press that one more on it. I got them in. Yeah. There is a small leakage of ectoplasm. But that's normal, you can pull that away. That's yeah. not a problem, that's not an issue if it does that. Okay. It's like that. Yeah, right, thanks for that, Gary. Yeah. Don't mention teenager's bedroom or anything like that at this moment <laughs> in time. Okay, so what are you trying to prove on the hand cam, apart from the fact you've got to... Uh, well, they're in there, so, yeah. Oh, right, so you, so you want a round of applause in. then, do you? Yeah, well, the, the, yeah, you said I couldn't do it, but there you go. Yeah, well, hmm, yes. So, yeah, you, I, I no think... No blue if plaque it, coming in my direction. Comment below. I think <laughs> if he'd addressed them neatly inside there, he would have been able to do it. And yes, he didn't prepare it. So imagine you put maybe 100 metres of cable in and you'd forgot your connector. You'd have been able to go all the way back to the start of the run, decleat it, or perhaps pull out the linear fire clips we oh, used and, and just put the uh, connection back on, wouldn't yeah, you? I've never, never done that. I've never, ever put an armoured cable through a ladder. No, you haven't. You've never had to saw that ladder in half, have you? And that ladder wasn't made of wood either, was it? No, it was no. aluminium, actually. <laughs> yeah, so, so that's a difference. With two short ladders. <laughs> Ideal, yeah. yeah, for two short people. So again, look out for that. We've done a review, separate review on the Fox Box. Yes. And, and the Fred. Fred. Yeah, and then we've gone on and done some other things linked to that as well. Those videos will be out in the coming months, I would mm -hmm. suggest. We've got a lot of material in our back catalogue obviously for you coming forward. So that's taken us through to that. Um, we're now gonna go back to an old favorite, aren't we? Yeah. Something where we used to tour in the old days. You remember when we used to be able to go out? We could go out and see people. See people, maybe yeah. in an event. An event, yeah. Yeah, we used to drag our, um, what we called them days, the apprentice wall. Yeah. We, we think we're gonna change the name, your yeah, challenge wall or something yeah, like race something wall. Like that. Or, yeah. Now, before we, we bring up the footage of this, this wall is all about one word and one word only, Gordon. What's that word? Fun. Fun. <laughs> yeah. We are not suggesting racing electrical wiring systems in is the way forward. We're doing it for one word and one word only, Gordon. That word is fun. Fun. Yeah. So for a bit of fun, we had our first guest, who's probably the person who's had the most attempts at this wall. Would you agree? He has. And let's see if he did manage to do uh, any better. OK, let's see what happened when the secret millionaire joined us here at Lineside Studios. So we brought the eFix Challenge World back and to start us off with this new season, there could only be one person we could invite along to do it. Someone who's probably had more attempts at it than anyone else. It is secret millionaire, Craig Gifford. <laughs> Oh, Craig, great you could come along. Thank you for having me. <laughs> yeah, so how's the, uh, oh, well, probably a year since he first tried the uh, eFix Challenge wall. It is, yeah, last, uh, what was it, 1st September. Yeah. And first first eFix September. Yeah, can you remember what your time was back then? I think it was 5.24, something, something around the five, mid five minute mark. <laughs> yeah, slow, as we yeah. used to call it at the time. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so you've had, a, you've had a whole year to practice since. What have you been doing in the last year? Ooh. What have I been doing? Oh, YouTube. Yep. Instagram. Um, not practicing my uh, my challenge wall. Yeah. Now clearly, what people don't realise is Craig's just masquerading as an electrician, but yeah. really is known as the secret millionaire. He spends all his time on social media recording some great videos for his YouTube channel. So I guess Craig, we'll have a look at what this time you brought round on the yeah, uh, on good, the challenge wall. Good to see what we've got. Let's have a look. Let's take our screws out fast start. and we'll go cables down because gravity should aid us in this endeavour. So as Craig settles in, what's your thinking on cables down, Gordon? Oh, for me. Any, any way that works, but yeah, I've seen, a, seen it both ways and yeah, well, well, we'll see as the show goes on. Oh, and we're in. A bit of luck there, down in here. Yep, so often stripping those ends, that looks a funny looking tool he's got there. Let's have a look at that later on. Back box. Yeah, I haven't seen one of them before. Yeah, you can bring your own kit this time, so we're going to see some strange tools, I would imagine, as we start this off. No impact driver, thank, uh, thankfully. Well, not yet. So CPCs are first, and then we'll be off on line and neutral now. Where are we? Just make sure we've got nothing surrounding that. No, we should be all right. There we go. 
avoided the rat's uh, nest of tangled cables there. That's always catching a few people out. Now they're trying to unknit them before pushing them back into the socket outlet there. Holding your screwdriver in your mouth, is that something you'd recommend, Gary? Well, no, we did feed him earlier on, but obviously he didn't have enough there. He's chewing down on his screwdriver. Screw, and then we're done at the bottom. Can focus Horizontal on screws, remember, have to be parallel. What? Back up right the top of the gun right into the, uh, into the consumer unit. Have those knees crack. Cable's in, so we're connecting up time. Well, that looked easy as well. Really giving bad electricians a bad name right now. Joe Blogs won't be happy. You have electricians a bad name. I think he gives hairdressers a bad name. That can't be. That's not a style. I would suggest he's had on his head. No, I think someone's used the nipex on the hair. Yeah, nice and tightly cut nice back. And, uh, reasonably good time coming. Who's talking the job in at the end? Last wire. What could possibly think go wrong? Fast. That's not always the case. Nothing. Not the confidence. Wow. So, did it make a big difference being able to use your own tools? Having done it a couple of times, yeah, it makes a massive difference because I'm used to the pressures needed to, to clamp down and cut and yeah, big, big difference. Yeah, and we've done a review of that tool because it's the first time we'd seen one. We'd had one hanging around for a while, but actually the first time we'd seen it being used. So check out that review if you yeah. haven't seen it. So I guess it comes down to it. Do you want to know your time? I do. So last time it was five minutes, 24. It was. If I said it began with a seven, would you be disappointed? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Craig Gifford. <laughs> you did this in three minutes, 38. It's a good time. <laughs> yeah. Woo! Top of the leaderboard! <laughs> so that is top of the leaderboard. We'll see how long you can stay up there, hopefully for a very long time. If you're not following Craig, check out his Instagram account and follow him on YouTube. Yeah. Some great videos there obviously masquerading as an electrician but is really the secret millionaire so thank you to craig gifford thank you wow okay so craig gifford not only is the fastest electrician currently in the uk he's also the fastest left-handed electrician <laughs> in the uk and that makes sure you're right-handed as well then yeah. wouldn't it's, it's, so we perhaps ought to put left and right against it maybe that should be another thing shouldn't it whether they're left-handed because i'm left-handed Ah, right. yeah. That's why you're so slow. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and rough and expensive. Yeah, they're all the things they used to call me when I was at work. Gaz, he's, 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 he's not only slow, he's rough yeah. and he's dear. No, that was a good time. Yeah, that, was, is, that, uh, is a, that is a healthy time. Three minutes, time. 30. Obviously, we have changed a few things there. You can bring your own tools now, mm. which is a... Gary used to give him a bread knife and, uh, yeah, <laughs> and a blunt screwdriver. Yeah. And, uh, Made a big difference, I think. Yeah. 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 So... Again, just to reiterate, it's fun. And how can you come along and use, obviously, our challenge wall and set a time and hopefully be interviewed by us? Mm -hmm. Just get in contact in the usual ways. Reach out to us on social media and we'll try and book you in. But, of course, if you do come along, we're going to expect you to do the, the challenge wall. Uh, and then that will be shown at some point in the future. That's yeah. what we'd like to have. Won't Absolutely. We? Come along and have a go. Yeah, come along and have a go. So that's back for good now, I think, isn't it? That's going to be it a is, yeah. We're going to try and do as many of those as we can. I think yeah. We've, but, yeah, we've got some people popping along to have another. He another doesn't know it, though, tomorrow, does he? <laughs> no, he doesn't know it. <laughs> he's coming along and he's like, well, you're going to be doing that. Yeah. And we suspect he's not an electrician. It doesn't matter. No. So, so, again, so we'll have left-handed, right-handed, non-electrician. So you yeah. could be the f fastest non electrician to complete the challenge wall as well. Mm. Okay, so that was good. I enjoyed bringing that back, but something that's currently in with us is the old sticker swap, isn't it? It is. Well, why are you doing well, that, Gary? Someone has asked, John the Builder's asked, if this Makita coffee machine's any good. Well, smell that coffee, Gary. Yeah, lovely. I'll take it. And he makes one, though, does it? Unfortunately, yeah. It's just yeah, one. Yeah, unfortunately, so. yeah. Just the one coffee. Yeah, just one coffee today. Okay. But and so, you found it a, a, a lot better than you did when you first got it. We thought it was the batteries that were the issue. What is the real issue? Uh, the real issue is, yeah, the water tank. It's not big enough, is it? Yeah, so if you wanted a cup of coffee now, Gary. Yeah, I've got... Uh, there's no water left, is there? There's no water left. Okay, yeah. so does it come out? No? Okay, oh, trust me, no water uh, in there for my coffee. Yeah, so yeah. Yeah, so, yeah, so just one cup at a time. But it does it quite quickly, doesn't it? We thought that was going to be its weakness. It does it from the time it takes Craig Gifford... <laughs> Oh, right. Three one. minutes, 38. Yeah. Fastest a left-handed electrician in the UK at the moment. And thank you very much for coming along, Craig. He gave up two days of his life, didn't he, come to us? He did. Yeah, which was really good. Right, sticker swap then. So we've had some in. So I'm going to show you what the bench looks like now. So let's see our bench. There it is. 
Craig Gifford's on there. We've got Kenny on there. We've got Dan from DJE Electrical Services. We've got an American one on there, haven't we? Wills Electrical. Wills Electrical's Midfield on there. Midfield General. The Midfield General, yeah. DJ Electrical. EV guys, which is very similar, I think, to what we would suggest. Hang on, we're on the back of Nine Plus's van. Yeah. That phone number doesn't look familiar, Gordon. Where's that? We've made it to Tenerife. We've made it to Tenerife. And oh. there's another little story there, isn't there, in Tenerife? Yeah, he was uh, working on a yacht. He was, yeah, working on a yacht owned by who? Craig Gifford. Craig Gifford, yeah. hashtag secret millionaire. So anchors, it, his, anchors his yacht in Tenerife over the winter. Yeah, and he got uh, Nine Plus to come along. Yeah, just, just service it a little bit, okay. do, a bit of, do a bit of testing on it. If you're watching it tonight, Nine Plus, and you reach out to us, um, we will send you something in the post that you've been anchoring after. So this is a test for you. If you haven't watched it tonight, and you don't reach out, okay? You won't get what you've been anchoring for. So if you message me sometime tomorrow or later on next week asking for the thing you keep asking for, I'll say, well, I offered you it, but you didn't get in contact. Yeah. Clock's ticking. Okay. Mm -hmm. So that's a sticker swap. So how do we get involved? Uh, yeah, if you want to stick, early bird gets near the top of the bench. And if you're near the top of the bench, there's a chance of getting more videos. <laughs> there is. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> and, uh, but don't get me wrong. We still like your sticker, even if it goes low down. Yeah. So, yeah. But we're going to work our way down that bench. We've got some other things to put stuff on. And yeah, we'll work our way down the street. Is it on the website? It is on the website now. The address it's efix.co.uk slash sticker swap. Okay. And yeah, if you just send the address in there, if not, just send us a message. Most people tend to find us. Yeah, well, we're not great at sending them out. We did some today. We have, we've caught up on the post today. Almost, we've, Almost we've, we've missed one. one. We've missed. Yeah, one, one yeah. we missed, we apologize for that. But yeah, we've sent a load of stuff out today, including some of the big prize winners post has gone already. They don't even know they've won. No, it's it on... is, yeah, we're ahead of the curve for yes. once that. So we've cleared the, <laughs> yeah. cleared the Friday what's post. It yeah, um, what's it called? Um, 48, isn't it? Um, Parcel Force 48. Yeah. So just a couple of days from now, you're gonna get your stuff. But you don't mm. know whether you won yet, you'll have to stay on to the end to find out. Yeah. Right, I think it's time to give another prize away, is it not? Another prize, yeah. And, that's, sorry, sorry. and that is, that's for one of our sponsors. So okay. we give away the supplies during our live feed events. It's, it's kind of uh, uh, the product or the, or the brand or whoever we've uh, managed to work sorry? with. The most. Sorry, what's that word you use? Brand. Brand. <laughs> Okay, so the brand that's won the prize. Okay, Joe, try and hold it together at home. Yep, so the, the, the brand, and we, we give this for their engagement, the number of views, the our feedback interest. we get on the product. Yeah, LinkedIn, they do a lot of work on LinkedIn and the rest of it. Yes. So having starred in all seven, yeah. I don't mind who wins this one. <laughs> <laughs> it's not my friend. <laughs> well, it was. Yeah, but it was. <laughs> yeah, I think it was. Yeah. I think you're the only person to appear um, in the north in a video on your own. In that was the only video you appeared on your own. In one, didn't yeah. it? In one. Yeah. Okay. So whatever. Who's one? It's Hamilton. It is Hamilton like that. So we have <laughs> these uh, USB sockets. And uh, yeah, people, people have spotted our props we've built. You know. Yeah, it's, it's very much like, I think, the real world. That so they, somebody thought our prop looked really good, didn't they, in one of our videos? Yeah. When you get close to it, it don't quite look as good as it perhaps does on camera. Yeah, and I've chipped it a bit now. But yes, we knocked this together in the joinery workshop, yeah, didn't we? JW. Yeah, a little bit of JW work gone on there, and we managed to knock that together. So we think they're great. So it was an, an easy one for us to give away as well, wasn't it? Yeah, it is. And I mean, the standout product for us, and we are, uh, a lot of people have asked about this. If you bring the hand cam in, oh, Gary, hand cam, hand cool. I'm, I'm going to press the right buttons at the right time. I'm pressing it. I'll just move the coffee machine. We're on hand cam. Oh, oh, oh hang on. Oh, right. oh, it's just like you. If you move too quickly, it leaks. Yeah, okay. So that one there, isn't it? Yeah, so this is the Euro module, and that'll charge up to 45 watts. It'll charge your laptop if you've got a USB-C on it, and it's great for higher power tablets. Yes. Um, so a lot of people have asked about that product. Um, it's not in stock yet, but it is coming in stock. And yeah, and we, and we will let you know because we want some. And, and I'd really consider Euro modules. You know, when you're looking at maybe higher um, outlets in bedrooms you know people aren't necessarily got radio alarm clocks now they, they have their phone for everything don't they yeah that those positioned in those areas where maybe you're going to have your, your bedside cabinets etc the euro module is really good and you would got one of these haven't you you got a usb a type yeah you went home didn't you popped in your new <laughs> usb c one didn't you yeah changed it over in seconds didn't yeah. you and so future proofs it don't it future proof yeah and we also featured in those little, these little testers that are good as well are you going to plug one of those in yeah, so hang on i'll bring it i'll slowly bring in hand cam i've got my mic on which is always handy so what, yeah. so you're going to bring one of these in so what are we going to do then so gordon plug it in here okay you're in there Handy little testers, these are. Yeah. Very inexpensive. Testers. Someone said, are your sockets straight, Gary? Of course they're not. I'm going to put no. some straight. Yeah. Thank you. I'll plug you in there. Hold on, I'm going to plug oh, you in. Put me in. Okay. So the phone's in, and we can yeah. see now. And that should start charging. It'll pick up, there it goes. Yeah. And we'll charge in through there. Okay. 
What are you doing? Fiddling. Lords. Okay. Yeah, stepped up now. It's at nine volts now. So okay. that was the good thing about these, the charge at a higher voltage. And how do I get hold of those, Gordon? Um, well, we'll let you know. It's, uh, it's Hamilton who are supplying them. And these? Uh, Oh, those? Oh, you made a tester. Absolutely, <laughs> I did. Yeah, that's what we were talking about, the tester. But I was going to let you off there because uh, you've, you've come back and... Uh, yeah. How do we get hold of these? Uh, they're, on, they're on Amazon. And again, in the video on that, we've left the link in it, haven't we? So yes, we you, have, yeah. You're going to be faffing around looking yeah. for them. If you go back to the Hamilton video, look in the description, you'll see it. But yeah, Euro modules. Uh, again, if you start using Euro modules, you haven't used them before, send in your photographs in the usual way. Let's have a look at your great work mm -hmm. and let's celebrate you as well because that brings us to... Electrician of the Month, mm. which Eddie won, didn't he? Our inaugural one. He did. And we're out there searching through uh, social media looking for our next uh, electrician. Yeah, for November. Yeah, we're in yeah. November. We are, it'll be the end yeah. of the month, it'll be yeah. the live feed. Live month. feed, yeah. next live okay. feed. So, yeah, so tag us in on your work. Yeah. Uh, and hashtag eFix, hashtag um, more power. Want to be yeah, extra points, but we'll right. yeah, great it's, examples of work, good sometimes projects. Sometimes easy just put at eFix in as well because that helps me find it as well. So, yeah. yeah, okay, so that's where we're up to on those. We've got we're holding if off you're now. in the pictures yourself, it's even better. Oh, yes. We do actually like to see, <laughs> you know, we, 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 we do get a little bit bored of looking at consumer units, yeah, yeah, just be in and be in yeah. the shots, put your head in the consumer unit. We're getting to that on. moment oh, where. Joe appears in these things, and that's usually a great moment for us. Yeah, it's time when we're thinking of this time, and like, I've got my coffee here. I just sort of. I've got a drink down here, but it's, I can't hidden get it out beverage. To, oh, yes, hidden beverage. I can't so it relax it. a little bit. It is. Maybe. And no better way to relax, I think, than in our new segment, which we like to call Regulation Corner. It's time for Regulation Corner. Hello, I didn't see you there. Welcome to Regulation Corner. Take a seat, get comfortable, pour yourself a drink. You know, I've just been sitting here with my Luden industrial socket and it really got me thinking about one of my favorite regulations. Let me just share it with you, I've got it here. Now it's Regulation 411.3.3 and it reads as follows. In AC systems, Additional protection by means of an RCD with a rated residual operating current not exceeding 30 milliamps shall be provided for socket outlets with a rated current not exceeding 32 amps and mobile equipment with a rated current not exceeding 32 amps for use outdoors. An exception to one is permitted where, other than for an installation in a dwelling, a documented risk assessment determines that RCD protection is not necessary. The requirements of regulation 411.3.3 do not apply to valve systems according to regulation 411.7 or reduced low voltage systems according to regulation 411.8. I'm sure you'll agree that that is an absolute classic. It's imbued with nuance and subtle meaning. But you know, that's enough from me. I'm sure you'll want to get on. Thanks for stopping by and the next time you're passing, drop in, say hello. There's always a place for you here at Regulation Corner. Good night. Absolutely brilliant. Just to calm things down a bit. Yeah, yeah. just, you yeah. learn so much in such a short space of time in, in, yeah. in Regulation Corner. So if you've got, a, if you've got your own favourite regulation you'd like Joe to look into, then I'm sure he'd, I'm sure he'd love to do it. it. He'll perhaps even rank them in his list of favourite regulations. So look out for the skits that are going to be coming up, which is Regulation Corner. So we'll be back with Joe at some point. Don't forget, he also does the news at Penn. So that'll be coming back very shortly as well. But I think we can just, just take a moment to absorb that regulation. Yeah, I think he's right. Mm. Nuance. Yeah, superb. Where are we going next, Gordon? <laughs> uh, yes. Well, just, just before we move on, so, yeah, we have had these in today. Being the massive yeah. wrestling fan that I am, it's probably another thing nobody knew about me. 
I'm pretty devastated I didn't get that one. Yeah. I'm pretty, you got that one. Yeah. Gordon got the... Uh, and I never watched wrestling. Yeah, you got the yeah. Hogan one. Yeah, and you oh. also got... <laughs> you, yeah, did I get some more? Here we go. Yeah, you got this. Yeah, that's... So uh, people know you feel under pressure. I am under pressure. I was last week, weren't I? <laughs> yeah, no mic, no sound, wrong picture. I think I'm doing all right at the minute. I'm just checking. Yeah, we seem to be doing okay. So, yeah, we got that one. I don't think that's a bad one. Yeah, mm. okay, you got one of your own? No. <laughs> <laughs> ah... Oh, taking that picture's not going to be a change either, is it? Okay. Uh, moving swiftly on. Okay, then, so we're probably at the stage now where we're going to need to release some more prizes. Mm. Okay, so uh, we've got our first person to complete all the questions correct on the um, lockdown live feed for October. Yeah. When you went over to efix.co.uk and you went to our live feed tab, there was a series of 14 questions. And if you were the first person after the live feed last Wednesday to get them all right, you're the first person. You get that big box of bits. You got a picture of the big box of bits. Uh, I've got some dial back there. The big yeah, box of bits. Oh, there, oh, there it is. You, you've got most of those. I most think. of those, <laughs> apart from the bits you haven't got from there. But yeah, yeah. Plus some. Yeah, plus one some of them didn't have a locking off kit, and I, I packaged the second one up and had to open the first one back up. So, hopefully, you've got all of those. If for some reason you're missing the loo, I apologise, but I think they both got lube in. Yeah. So, the first person to complete them. That was. Now it was close. Now it was, a lot of people got close. A lot of people did it. Possibly faster, but didn't get them all right. But the first person to get them all right was Mark Holmes. So Mark Holmes, that yeah. box is already It's already, already on the way. way and they got say, your address. They, they say that in a lot of things, don't they? It'll be on the way to you. Well, it is. Yeah, we it posted, is. We've, we've we posted, posted it that today. today. So that's gone already. I think that's gone to Kendall. We could have almost driven it there. Yeah, we could have done. So you're supposed to take longer than, yeah, we mm. would have whipped it around. So congratulations to, to Mark for winning that. So that meant that everybody else was... Of the hundreds of people that got all the questions right, because there was a lot of people, yeah. we randomly selected the next winner. Yes. Okay, so would you like to suggest who won the next one? Exactly the same box? That it, yeah, same box. Yeah. Minus some bits, Gary may or may not yeah, put may in. Not put in. <laughs> <laughs> and that's going to uh, Paul Moore. Paul Moore, okay. Who I believe is in the Norfolk area. Okay, so Paul, if you're watching this evening, congratulations. It's in the post, so you're probably only two days away from owning that yourself. Okay, and again, if you can send us some pictures and perhaps put them on your Instagram stories or share them with us, of you uh, with your goodies, that would be great as well. Okay, mm. so is uh, is there anything else you'd like to cover? Uh, coming up, we've got this. Yes. Some, uh, oh, you so, can't see it on the camera. There's some special oh, cable under this. Don't too much away. There's, I'll just a, just sneakily give everybody a little look. So just press this one. Just sneak yeah. down. We've had a cable delivery, and this Ooh, has come that all doesn't, the way from uh, it's come all the way from Switzerland. This one, so Swiss cable, didn't Swiss come cable. with the watch. Okay. Didn't come with any gold. All right, so, um, we're, so are we doing a room, we're having a look at that, aren't we? We've got to figure out how it all works. And, yep, uh, yeah. got some more live feed videos. So this month there'll be another chunk of videos coming out and another load of prizes. We think we're gonna do, are we gonna do a mega bundle again? Yeah, we're gonna try it, yeah. We're, uh, yeah. People have asked about the Wii uh, X, XL tool case, <laughs> but well, I don't know. We'll see what we can do on that. We're gonna give one of them away if we can. Well, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see okay. if we are can do us a, a, a wee hard deal. A wee hard deal. Tell them how much I love Speedy One. That's <laughs> well, that's probably yeah. Well, you're not getting the Christmas card. We know that much. So. <laughs> love the Speedy One. Yeah. Okay. Yep. So that's mm. really good. So that's about where we are now. So we we thank you as always for your massive interaction. Um, this brings to close this week's live stream. We're mm. not live streaming at the moment, we believe, next week, are we? Have a week no, off? No, week off next week because we've got to do some work. Yeah, and then we're jumping into the following week where we'll probably be launching... The next live feed. Yeah, the next live feed or talking about what sort of videos are coming up in the next week or two. Yeah. So, yeah, we're going to be growing these. So next time you see us live, maybe we'll... Yeah, because they won't see any of the ones we shoot in between. Well, I'm sure. Well, yes, you will. Why is that? Because obviously every video we shoot. Yeah, but we don't release. We, we've got a back catalogue we've been releasing. Yeah, but there's a few. There's a few pushed to the front. So. Oh dear. Okay. <laughs> well, we'll keep doing this. One last thing for me. I'd like to thank the uh, accommodation I'm staying at. I'm staying at the railway at the moment. And when I got back last night, believe it or not, they left me out a set of knives and forks because I'm obviously on takeaway food because there's no uh, restaurants open. And a bottle of wine in the fridge and a glass, and just said, just have a, a little relax tonight, Gary. So that was really nice of the railway. So mm. thank you very much to the railway. And we'll leave you on that note, and we'll hopefully see you in, what, two weeks? Two weeks. Two weeks' time. Uh, check out the videos. There's one every day from Efix, and uh, there's there is at the moment, yeah. There's a video a day. So there's plenty of you to, to watch. Interact with us. Follow us on Instagram. Okay, hopefully you're following us and subscribe to us on YouTube. And we'll see you next live stream in two weeks.